What's going on, YouTubers? I'm Wrestling God Bitch. This is my wrestling thoughts, and obviously, these are my wrestling thoughts. I want to talk about something. Um, first of all, tonight is the Royal Rumble, the 2012 Royal Rumble. But that's not why I'm here. I want to talk about a little subject. A lot of people out there say wrestling is fake. You know, stuff like that. I tell people, yeah, I watch wrestling. I'm a big fan of wrestling. And they go, you know it's fake, right? No. Actually, it isn't all fake. Sure, the punches and the kicks, they're fake. Yeah, they are. Uh, for those of you who don't know, when they throw a punch, they do an open hand. That's why when you see, let's say, The Rock throw his punches, it looks like he's slapping them. It's because he's actually like, slapping them. Like he, he goes like this to go hit him, but when he reaches their face, he goes like this, like like, like that. Same with Booker T. Etc. Etc. Anyway, for those of for you doubters out there that say, "Oh, it's fake," I want you to tell me right now. How do you fake jumping off of a 15-foot ladder onto a table? How do you spear somebody through the ropes? Through a table that is on fire. How do you fake that? How do you fake jumping off a 15 foot high steel cage? How do you fake falling off of a 20 foot high hell in a cell onto an announcer's table? You can't. There's no way to fake that. That's real shit. Um, granted, of course, WWE and TNA, they're both scripted. They're not fake. It's like a, uh, it's like a soap opera for men and some women. It was originally created for men. Um, anyway, it's not all fake. I mean, I really want to know that. I mean, it, it cracks me up. Yeah, there's ways to not get hurt when you're hit with a steel chair but you're still getting hit with a steel chair alright it's an aluminum chair but come on that's still gotta hurt at least a little when you get hit with it um what else is there Shane McMahon's a prime example jumping off the Titan Tron onto Kane's body the Titan Tron there's no way to fake that he fell, what was it, like 30, 40 fucking feet? You can't fake that, man. He fell. When he jumped, he fell. 40, 30 or 40 feet through, I, I, I'm guessing they're tables that are set up, you know, under the stage and shit. But he fell through them. That's not fake, man. You cannot fake that. It's scripted, yes. They go over what they have to say. They go over what they have to do in the match. But when they do it, like, I don't know. Let me go smaller here. I don't know if any of you have ever been suplexed. But it fucking hurts. And you gotta take into consideration, the mat is just foam over plywood. That's it. And then a cover over that. That's it. Foam and plywood. It's all there is. That shit hurts. Especially if you're getting suplexed by a six foot guy. That means you're getting thrown in the air six feet and then slammed onto the ground. It hurts. I know it hurts. It has to hurt. So sometimes when you see a guy go like after being choke slammed on the mat or something like that, it's a real expression, man. So like I said before, it's scripted, yes. Everything they say, it's already been written. And they were handed a script, and then that's how they're reading off of it. Um, except, of course, what they call a shoot promo. When it's called a shoot promo, it's strictly from the heart. Like, um, when CM Punk flipped out... Well, not flipped out, but when CM Punk did a shoot on Monday Night Raw where he sat on the stage and he just started shooting at everybody. You know, Vince McMahon and the McMahon family and Triple H and all that. It was real. 
those real words, real feelings, real emotions. Um, but other than that, pretty much everything else is fake. I mean, scripted, I'm sorry. Um, that aside, you can't fake a lot of what goes on in WWE. I want to talk about the injuries. Triple H had to have surgery on his quads twice. He was out for eight months apiece. It's 16 months if you put it together. You can't fake that. There's been guys in WWE that needed neck surgeries, uh, back surgeries, um, knee surgeries. Rey Mysterio is a prime. So he needs knee surgeries all the time. Um, there's just so... Oh, Edge with his uh, Achilles heel. He needed surgery on that. Um, or Achilles tendon, I'm sorry. He needed surgery on that. It's just a lot of this stuff is not fake. As fake as you guys think. Um, so for those of you that are out there saying wrestling is fake, I dare you to do what they do throughout the year. And I guarantee within a month you'll realize it's not as fake as you think it is. They, there's a reason they pay their superstars so much money. And it's because they have to put their bodies through so much pain throughout the year. John Cena makes $6 million a year. Triple H makes $10 million a year. Not even going to get into how much Vince makes a year. Wrestling, bottom line, ladies and gentlemen, wrestling is scripted. And the punches and the kicks are tweaked. Above all else, everything else, not big. That's real pain. I just want you guys to know that. That's my thoughts on it. Alright. Take care. Thanks for joining.